Hi hey there, this update is for Sunday the 7th of May uh, 2023 and the early hours of Monday morning of the 8th of May 2023. I'll do the rest of the, to the Monday and tomorrow's update, but I thought we'd share it today while it's still fresh in my mind. So yesterday, um, being the Sunday, there's not a lot happens, so... Um, I was here in my room. Uh, I basically, the doctors did the rounds, I don't know, what, about 11 o'clock-ish. It was only one round of the weekend. I kind of missed them because I was falling asleep because I didn't sleep right, properly for like three, four days at night. Um, <clears throat> but there's not much really else happened, apart from my usual sort of antibiotic drips. And then um, my um, TAS, what well, it's, it's called, and uh, telepressin um, injection into the cannula, which basically just goes straight through me. But um, other than that, there was nothing really impressive. But the doctor came in and says, I need to get more hemoglobin. I think well, my hemoglobin had dropped, so I had to get more blood. Buds. Unfortunately, those bloods didn't come to about, um, I don't know what. 11 o'clock at night, possibly. 10, 11 o'clock at night. And apparently it was two units I was to get, not just the one pint of blood, it was two units. So that's three hours each. Plus, in between that, I had more telepressin, more um, TAS as well. Um, <clears throat> so, and then you're on the blood pressure machine constantly till about five, ten past quarter past five in the morning, on the Monday, and then <clears throat> this morning, basically, and then that's, um, they came in at the back of sex to take blood to, because usually about an hour after the, the blood transfusion finishes, they take the blood to see who they've gone. So the nurse came in, managed to get blood out of me first time, so that was good. Um, because I'm usually a bit tricky nowadays with all the fluids I'm carrying. So uh, I've not had one minute's sleep last night at all. Not one minute. Um, from Michelle leaving, I used to kind of doze till about one in the morning or something. And that's me. But then last night it was just absolutely nothing because we're in and out, in and out, in and out. Drip on, drip change, drip just beep, 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 machines and everything. It was just horrendous. So, um, as you can probably tell from my voice, it's not, I'm not in the best in frame of mind and best in moods today. Um, I still want home on Wednesday, um, but obviously that depends on the medical profession and what they say, and how we things progress over the next two days, I guess, month of today, tomorrow, and Wednesday as well, so the three days, how they progress, and then we'll take it from there. Um, if I need to stay to the Friday, I need to stay to the Friday, yeah. But honestly, enough is enough. That's like five weeks, Wednesday will be five weeks I have been in the hospital completely, five weeks and I cannot do any more. My mental health is suffering really badly now. Um, I'm not seeing any life at all outside, and I'm just the nurses popping in now and again. They're busy as hell, they're in the ward areas, and I'm in the side room, and you very rarely see them. You only see them when you push the buzzer if you need something, and blah, blah, blah. But, um, <clears throat> so you've not really anybody to speak to, you're isolated um, as well. My mobility is coming along nicely. Um, I managed to walk big distance, bigger distances every day. Um, and doing the stairs as well. Plus the um, physio popped in just before I did this video just to say she's going to come back. And, and there's anything I need to work on with her. And, I, and she says about like, think, say for example, balance and get out of bed easier. I says, yeah, that'd be perfect. So she's going to come back after lunchtime 
um, and work with me just to help me work on how to get out of bed and stuff like that easier. So, um, hopefully that'll all be fine. Um, but um, to this morning I'm absolutely gunning for the doctors because I have no idea why I'm still on, I am on these uh, drips, the telepressin and the TAS. I have no idea whatsoever. Nobody's explained it to me. I have no idea what they do, what they're for, anything at all. Anybody who has any days, put them in the comments, but who knows. Um, but anyway, as you can tell, I'm, I'm pretty raging just this morning, so it's probably just my frame of mind. Anyway, I'll leave it there and I'll update you all um, in tomorrow's uh, vlog about what, what happened for the rest of today. Right, thank you. Right, bye.